Well, the Grand Island Public Works Department has announced their one and six year street improvement plan for the city. Some projects are major undertakings, while others will just simply be improving the driving conditions. And local force Kit Kloniger takes us to GI tonight, where the focus is on a frequent problem intersection, right, Kit? That's right, Spencer. If you've ever driven through the Five Points intersection at Broadwell Avenue and State and Eddy Streets, you know it can be a bit confusing. But GI Public Works have a, have a solution which will be implemented in the coming year. With so much crossing traffic, the GI Five Points intersection is one of the worst in the city, and the Public Works Department just released their plans to fix it, with the solution being a roundabout. And a roundabout, because you have the big circle in the middle, they have to enter the roundabout and, and, and follow the rules. There's no choice. In 2018, there were 80 reported collisions at the intersection, with many more uncounted minor incidences. And officials say a roundabout would greatly reduce the hazards. Reported collisions, those with damage over $1,000, uh, should go way down. Definitely nowhere near the 80 that we're having now. Unlike the current situation at the Five Points intersection, you only have to worry about the traffic on your left at a traffic circle. Usually very minor collision, very minor damage. Injuries are extremely rare. The new roundabout at 13th Street and North Road has been successful with drivers as they got used to the traffic flow. This new project would be 80% federally funded, with other revenue coming from the recent half-cent sales tax increase. Other places in the long-term plan are being considered for a traffic circle, including near the new hospital complex and on Old Potash Highway, though more traffic studies are yet to be done. Additional projects to be done in the next year will be lighting southern portions of Highway 281 and resurfacing several roads.